Open Inference is about to change everything. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to get free access to some of the most powerful AI models out there. DeepSeek, Quinn, Kimmy, all running inside of VS Code. And it won't cost you a cent. Most people, sadly, are still paying 20 bucks a month for ChatGPT+. Plus. Some are paying hundreds for Claude Pro or GPT-4 API, but you don't actually have to do that anymore. With the setup that I'm about to show you, you can get the same, sometimes better, performance completely free. In fact, in certain cases, it actually outperforms ChatGPT. And by the end of this video, you will have these models running on your own machine. So here's what we're gonna do. First, I'll break down the three-part combo that makes this work. Then I'll walk you through the exact setup step-by-step. -step. And along the way, I'll show you live demos, including real code and real outputs, so that you can see just how powerful this is. So let's kick things off with the powerful three-part combo that makes this possible. First, open inference. That is the brain. Second, open router. That's the bridge that connects you to dozens of models with a single API. And third, kilo code the VS Code extension that ties it all together so that you don't need to mess with complicated setups. Now, here's why this matters. Open Inference isn't just one model. It's an entire ecosystem of open source models that are production ready. We're talking multiple DeepSeek variants, Quen models, Kimi, and more. These aren't toys. Companies are really using them for real work. DeepSeek V3 alone has a 120,000 token context window. To put that into perspective, that's like feeding it an entire book and then asking it detailed questions. Compare that to ChatGPT4, which tops out at 8,000 tokens in the base tier, and the difference is massive. So how do you actually get access? Well, that's where Open Router comes in. Normally, if you want to use different models, you'd have to juggle multiple accounts and API keys. Open Router solves that because it gives you one API key that unlocks dozens of different models in one place. And the best part, they've got free tiers, so you can literally get started without putting in a credit card. Now, maybe you're thinking, that sounds cool, but I don't want to mess with raw APIs, I just want something that works. Well, that's where Kilo Code comes in. It's a free VS Code extension that connects to Open Router, and once you paste in your API key, you can start generating, refactoring, and debugging code instantly, all without leaving your editor. So, let's set this up. Step one is to install Kilo Code. So open your VS Code Marketplace, search for Kilo Code, and then hit install. It's free and it's open source. Step two is to set up your Open Router account. So just go to openrouter.ai, just sign up, and generate an API key. You're gonna copy that and you're not gonna share that with anybody, just keep that unique in a safe place. Step three, head back into VS Code. You're gonna open the Kilo Code settings, you're gonna select Open Router as your provider and then paste in your API key. Step four is to pick your model. So scroll through the list and you're gonna see Open Inference options, DeepSeek, Quinn, Kimmy, and a lot more. So just select the one that you want and you are pretty much ready to roll. So I'm gonna ask DeepSeek right here to create a node.js function that calls the Open Router API and logs usage statistics. Now watch this. In just a few seconds, it generates clean, documented code. Error handling, proper structure, everything. Normally, this would have taken me 15 to 20 minutes and the AI just did it instantly. Now, let's take it a step further. So I'm gonna ask it to refactor that same function into TypeScript without proper typing. And look at this. Interfaces, type definitions, error handling, production-ready code, all done in seconds. This is the kind of power that we are talking about. And we can take it another step further because it's not just coding. Quen models are incredible for reasoning tasks, data analysis, problem solving, strategic planning, and Kimi shines in multilingual tasks. So if you work with international clients or you need to generate content in multiple languages, it handles all of that beautifully. The beauty of this stack is that you can switch between models instantly. If you need coding help, pick DeepSeek. If you're doing research, just switch to Quen. And if you're translating content, just fire up Kimmy. One key, one interface, and it's all free. Now you might run into a few hiccups, so let me cover those really quickly and tell you how to fix them. The first issue is authentication errors. So if you're getting API errors, just double check your API key and make sure that there aren't any extra spaces and that you selected open router in the Kilo code settings. 
The second issue is weird or hallucinated outputs. And this can happen with any model, so if the results look strange, just switch to another model. Sometimes DeepSeek handles it better, sometimes Quinn. Just experiment and see what works for you. The third issue is rate limits. So even though these models are free, there are still usage caps. So if you hit one, either wait for it to reset or consider a paid plan. Honestly though, the free tier is generous enough for most people. Now let me show you just one more demo because this is all so cool and this is where it really starts to sink in. So I asked the AI to build a Python web scraper that pulls data from multiple websites and saves it into a database. And in under a minute, it generated a complete script error handling, database connections, rate limiting, everything. A professional developer would have needed hours to put this together, but the AI did it instantly. And this isn't just a toy example either. You could actually deploy this exact thing. And again, this isn't something that ChatGPT Plus users can do out of the box either. They'd still be paying monthly, dealing with smaller context, and missing out on the flexibility that you are seeing demonstrated right here. Now, let's zoom out for just one second. This isn't just about saving money, though that part is obviously huge. It's about the shift that we're seeing in AI right now. Closed platforms like OpenAI, they need to recoup massive R&D costs, so they charge subscription fees. Open inference, on the other hand, is community driven. The infrastructure costs are shared and the models are built by the community for the community. It's the same model that made Linux successful. Instead of everybody paying Microsoft or Windows, the community built something better and they gave it away for free. That is what is happening here with AI. If you're not taking advantage of it, you are missing out on a massive opportunity. So if I was just starting out with AI right now, here is exactly what I would do. I would set up this stack, open inference, open router, kilo code, and then I'd build small projects to get familiar with how these models think. Then I would test different models for different strengths, deep seek for code, Quinn for reasoning, Kimmy for multilingual. And then I'd look at how to monetize, how to build tools for clients, how to automate parts of my business, or how to create content faster than all of my competitors. Once you see what these models can do, it's impossible not to start thinking about applications. So that's it. You now have the ability to run some of the most powerful AI models in the world directly inside VS Code for free. And this is why so many people are saying goodbye to ChatGPT, because once you realize that you can get this level of power and flexibility for free, it's hard to go back to paying money for something that you can do for free, right? So. Go set it up, try it, experiment with the models, and then let me know in the comments what you are building with it, because that's super interesting to me. And as always, if this was helpful, hit that like button and subscribe for more of this kind of content. I've got more breakdowns coming that dive even deeper into the AI tools that are changing everything right now. Because honestly, this is just the beginning. Peace.